later. Who do I take? All right, look, 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 your boss is here. All right, they're all coming out. All right, they're all coming out. Who do I want? Which one? Okay, you want to talk about talk things. About uh, you want to talk about the whatever hell? You want to talk about <laughs> King's Clare? King's Clare. How about King's Clare? Yeah, yeah, yeah. What about King's Clare? Carl, we got to meet there. Right. You guys got to understand about public safety. I'll talk to you later. We're working on that. Okay. Listen. Uh, it's alright to go around and say, what's that Prince Edward Island song? 1-800-565-7201, uh, was it? Remember that? Yes, yes, yes. Yeah, remember? One remember day, that. one day. I one remember day. that, yeah, yeah. Yeah, so you go around and you say, okay, you Call me, yep. What's your phone number again? 238-5550. Okay. And then you turn around and talk about fresh immersion. Yep. Boat, 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 fresh immersion. Yep. But then you have to look at issues in your writing. Sure. And you know exactly what I'm talking about. Sure. The thing well, that I've had. What, what am I talking about? I would hope, well, I, I would assume you're talking about the speed limit on the road up by King's Clear and along the old highway. And that's your writing, yep. the old trans Canada Highway. Yep. And the natives open their known gas bar, yep. the anchor of the community, and the only gas bar that it says 100 kilometers an hour yep. in, your, in your browser. Yep. Okay, I'll shut up and let you talk. Go ahead. Well, we've had I've had a good number of me since the election. It was one of the things I talked about in the campaign was first supporting the underpass, which the community put in. We've seen that, yeah. Uh, but the speed limit's still too high. Talking to Minister it's Still Oliver, too high, 100. It's, too, it's, too, it's crazy. Yeah, uh, and they're flashing, flashing yellow lights there. Yeah, well, they put those in to try and slow people down. But if you've got a speed limit, if you've got a sign that says 100 kilometers an hour, and then you literally, like 10 meters later, you come down over the hill, yeah. and you can see the gas bar on the right-hand side of the road, just a few feet away. Yeah. It's not, it shouldn't be 100, it yeah. should be lowered down, so we're working on that, so, to make it happen. What are you gonna, you're the local MLA, never mind uh, your phone number, and what's the other thing, French immersion. When are you gonna look into that? You're the oh, MLA. I've already done it. It's uh, already, I've had several meetings, got the uh, DTI is doing the traffic study on it, when that comes back. Oh, yeah, yeah, study what, what, five to five people dies, or? Well, no, but Charles, you can't just go around just randomly, just randomly upping or down, putting things down. You gotta actually have a process for it. And so they're doing that. And I've got every confidence that at the end of that, that they'll see the speed limit large. That's the right thing to do. There's, like you said, there's no other place where you've got a limit like that. You go down to the old, uh, the old highway down uh, in Wellsford. And there's the, the golf course on one side of the road and the, the gas bar on the other. And there used to be a little, was it Helena's restaurant there? And the speed limit down yeah. there drops way, way down yeah, exactly. on a road that's uh, much less used. Is it because the uh, white man, natives? Is it. Uh... Well, I think there hasn't been the pressure, and that's why we, I'm putting the pressure on. We'll make it happen. Okay, one more thing. Yeah. Why do I get involved in these goddamn things anyway? I have no idea. 